back with another five tips and tricks video for when you first enter Gotham. When you first enter Gotham, you're going to end up here. The five tips you're going to need to know are as followed. Number one, find a vehicle. Number two, uh, set up your bank. Number three, get a phone. Number four, make some outfits. And number five, get a job or start selling drugs. Let's get into All right, it. Starting with number one, um, I already set this vehicle here. Uh, but you'll just look around on the city, look for a vehicle. Uh, the first thing you always want to do is find a vehicle so you have transportation to everything else. Um, number two step is right here where you start. You're going to go inside the bank. You're going to set up your bank, which I'll uh, show you how to do now. So you'll access your bank account. As soon as you access your bank, all you want to do is deposit, or I'm sorry, not deposit, withdraw a thousand dollars and then you want to go to your settings and you want to change your pin. You always want to just change your pin. We'll do four zeros for now. Um, you change your pin this way it gives you access to use all ATMs around the city. If you don't change your pin it will say that you can't, you don't, you won't have access to ATMs basically. You'll have to come back to the bank. Um, so you want to set up a pin right away, uh, that way it gives you access to the ATMs. And then step number three, as I said, we'll go to the phone store. So if you don't know where it is, you go to your map, you'll go here in the middle island to Manhattan, just scroll down until you find 410, 411, and you'll click on this logo here, and this will be the Apple store. So you can go ahead and set your waypoint there. Come into Times Square, and then on your left where all this glass is with the Apple logo, you gotta stop here, go inside, and the reason for pulling out that thousand dollars is because you need a cash on hand to get a phone. So you'll just grab one phone and then just keep that 500 bucks on you. Okay, so after you grab your phone, you can open up your phone by hitting your uh, key binded setting. Um, you'll click to open, click your language. You can skip the code. Um, honestly, nobody can get your phone. And click to get started. And then your phone's all set up. This will be good to have because you can have all your job stuff, your, your bank account all on here, your Twitter apps, things like that. And then on to step number four, you can just turn straight around and go up to the Gucci store here in Times Square. So if you don't know where it is, it's just going to be the t-shirt logo straight up the street uh, from the Apple store. So you stop right here out in front of these doors. And then you'll just walk inside. When you walk inside, just stand like right here around the back area. It'll say E to change clothing. You'll click on change clothing. Uh, and then just make your next outfit whatever you want I'm just gonna throw on a hat for now uh, you'll save it save customization I always tell people just make sure you walk out of the store and then do the command that I taught you in the other video slash OB to drop an outfit bag when you drop your outfit bag you'll just wait until it loads up open your outfit bag and then save current outfit and then you can just name it to whatever you're liking and like I said before, you can have up to 15 outfits. So you can go back into the store if you want more outfits. But that's just a good tip to have. That way, you have all your outfits ready for, you know, the week. And you're set and you don't have to keep coming back to the store. You can just have your outfits already ready to go. That's why it's a good starter tip. Um, the last uh, tip is uh, the biggest tip. Uh, it's to find a job or sell drugs. Uh, most people are just going to go to the second route. But if you want to be on uh, like a good a citizen route you would just either fill out an application inside the discord which is in the other tip tutorial uh, for EMS PD um, and if you want to do a citizen job you can also come over here in Times Square to this big purple eye it's gonna be the job center you just walk up here You'll access the job center and then you'll just pick any of these jobs here and apply for the job. If you have previous records uh, with the PD, um, it could hold you back from getting one of those jobs. 
And then the other step is going to be to sell drugs. So that's the reason that you want to keep that 500 bucks on you uh, after buying the phone because it will get you your first couple of pooch bags. Pooch bags is like what you need uh, to create the drugs and get the formula. Um, I can't show you the location of where the drugs is. That's something you'll have to RP out in your city, but I will show you how to process and sell. So we'll go ahead and get the pooch bags here at the store. Grab as many as you can. Okay, after you grab the 50 or so, because you always want to keep a little bit of money on you. You never want to use all your money at once. And then off to uh, make the drugs. Like I said, I can't show the location due to RP purposes, but once you find it, I'll show you how to make it and uh, sell it. All right, guys, and then for step number five, if you're going to choose to sell drugs and do that route, you'll just take these 50 pooch bags that you got, and then you're going to go and find the drug location. Obviously, for RP purposes, like I said before, I can't show where the location is, but you'll go up to this green circle here, and you'll just start processing. So you'll flex your e-muscle, and it'll start uh, grabbing baggies. There you go. Or I'm sorry, it starts grabbing the cocaine. And then once you get the like a good amount of cocaine, like you want to just save up. I believe it's every five bags is um or every one bag is five cocaine, I wanna say. Uh, I could be wrong, I'm not sure on the math. But you'll just grab a bit of cocaine. After you do that, um you'll go over here to the blue circle and then you'll start processing it. It will not let you process it unless you have pooch bags. Okay, so just make sure that you have pooch bags. Okay, there you go. Go ahead and process some more. And you don't even have to keep pressing E. You can just sit here, um, I believe, until uh, you have enough cooking. Okay, so once you get your coke pouches, you would then go out into the city and sell it, which uh, we'll do that now. Okay, so, and then, like I said, just to get started, you're gonna just uh, think slash dealer. And dealer, the difference between dealer one and dealer two is dealer is your normal drugs, your little drugs, um, like the pouch stuff. Dealer two is gonna be your brick drugs. Um, so you'll have to RP it out to figure out how to do that. Uh, obviously you can just meet people and they can probably teach you how to do things like that. So you do slash dealer and it's going to try to find somebody in the area to sell to. Once uh, it finds a client, you're going to see a customer come walking up to you. And as soon as he comes up to you, he's either going to let you give him the drugs for money or he's going to try and rob you. Hey. There you go, do the process. Right. Now when you do this, cops will be notified, so you want to get out of Dodge. If you want to keep risking selling before they show up, honestly that's your call. But I hope these five tips and tricks uh, to start off in Gotham City helped you guys. If it did, please let me know down in the comments. If you guys have any questions at all on either of the tips and tricks videos, leave a comment down below and let me know what you need to know. And I'll, get my, I'll do my best to get the answer for you. Alright, peace out everybody. Have a good one.